everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, I'm still alive. And in today's video, we are doing another home goods walkthrough. Plus, they have started putting out Halloween decor at TJ Maxx. So you will see a few items at TJ Maxx towards the end of this video. But right now, we are walking through home goods. I'm checking out this Frankenstein bust. He is $19.99. And then they have this Bride of Frankenstein for $19.99, Maleficent's eyes, Frankenstein's eyes, and the Bride of Frankenstein's eyes all light up. And then they have this mummy for $24.99 and he is in the larger size. They have a smaller size, I think I may have shown him previously, and a smaller size in a previous Home Goods walkthrough. Also, if you are new to my channel, I, if you see something in the background that I don't pick up and show you, it's probably because I have already shown it in a previous video. If you want to check any of those videos out, I will link them in the description box down below. This stack of jack-o'-lanterns is a solar light. And then they have this marble skull. I thought he was really cool. He was $12.99. I have shown these both previously, but they were in the smaller size. I'm actually grabbing the Marilyn Monroe right now in the small size and doing a comparison so you can see how much bigger the larger one is. And the larger ones are $24.99 a piece. I am gonna go ahead and start rambling for a moment. I wanted to know if you guys would be interested in seeing a spooky slash Halloween slash gothic fridge organization. I just purchased a new refrigerator and I want to organize it anyways and I want to do it with my spooky Tupperware and stuff so you guys should let me know if that's something you'd be interested in. And like I said, I have to do it anyways, so should I film it? So they have this little candy dish with mummy hands holding it, and it's kind of tilted for $12.99. I really liked this. I don't know why I didn't purchase it. Um, I totally should have. And then they had a couple of these Halloween ceramic Christmas trees, and you can barely tell that I'm pushing the light button, but I did push the light buttons on these. They have these witches again this year. Unfortunately, I did not get a price. I cannot, for the life of me, remember if she was $29.99 or $39.99. It's been a few days since I filmed this, but she does have a little broom that she's holding and it lights up, which I thought was really cool. They have this beaded pumpkin for $9.99 and the eyes and the nose on this pumpkin just remind me of Jack Skellington. I thought this was cute. And then they had this cat sitting in front of what I can only assume is the moon 
and this was $12.99. They have this jack-o'-lantern mummy and this is in a larger size. He is $24.99. You will see the smaller size towards the end of the video, towards the end of the home goods portion of the walkthrough. And then they had a couple of these cat wreaths. I did have to slow this clip down because I got a little too fast with the recording. And then they had this one. I personally liked this one a lot more than the previous one. They were both $16.99. And then they had this really cute gold skeleton couple for $14.99. And then they have this tombstone, and I really liked this. I liked the little pun on the name, Buried Alive. Anyways, um, if you guys didn't know, my name is not actually Stella. My name is Chelsea, so hi. Um, <laughs> Stella Live is just a name that I found punny. Like, I'm still alive, haha, <laughs> get it? <laughs> Anyways, that's where my name comes from. My name's actually Chelsea, so hello. And then they have a couple more of these stacks of skulls. Their eyes light up. I showed the black one as well, but I don't think I turned on his eyes. I think I totally forgot to even do that, so my apologies. And then they had this skeleton. I am not sure how tall he is. So with these cone Halloween tree things, I forgot to pick up the black one and record it. I literally picked it up and looked at the price and then I put it down. I don't know what I was thinking, but the black one is $24.99 and then the purple one was $16.99. And then with this broom stand, again, I forgot to get the price on this as well. And I don't even want to attempt to give you a price on how much I think it is because I'd probably be totally wrong. And then they had this cute little bat. I was tempted to purchase this for my son. This is $9.99. I liked the little tie-dye wings and ears. I thought this was so cute. And then here we have the jack-o'-lantern mummy in the smaller size that we saw earlier. And this guy is $12.99. They had these cute little witchy cats for $9.99. And then they had this white pumpkin with the bat cut out. We saw one of these in a previous video with the jack-o'-lantern face, but the mouth was a bat cut out. And then they had this skeleton hand candle holder. This reminds me of the Bath and Body Works candle holder. And then they had this spiky pumpkin. This was $12.99. Now, I could not for the life of me remember if I had shown this in a previous video or not, so I am going to stick it right here. And then I found this cute little Frankenstein guy. He was $7.99.
They have this purple iridescent skull and this was $9.99. And then they also had this black skull with the white spots and this was $9.99 as well. And then finally, the last new thing that I saw put out at HomeGoods was this skull for $12.99. We are now moving on to TJ Maxx. I found this black skull on this gold pedestal. And then the only candle that was put out was this leather musk one, and this was $7.99. It had a little ghosty lid on it. And then, yes, I have shown these next two items, this skull and the next skull, in a home goods walkthrough, but I know not everybody lives right next to a home goods. Some people have TJ Maxx, some people have Marshalls, some people have home goods, some people have all three. But I wanted to put them in here just in case it's an item that you wanted. You will know that TJ Maxx has it as well. I do know that they are like sister stores but they don't always have the same things. And then they have this beauty headband for $3.99, another beauty headband for $3.99 as well. They actually had quite a few of these beauty headbands and I do show them in this video. However, the book box that is right next to this jack-o-lantern, I totally forgot to show that. So the next time when I'm in the store filming, I will try to remember to film that. I did at least film this one and I thought this book box was really cool because it's like a stack of three boxes and it's a lot larger than the ones that I have filmed at HomeGoods and this was $16.99. They had this matte light pink light up pumpkin for $9.99 and no surprise to me, it's Martha Stewart. And then they had a few different inflatables. And these are apparently inflatables that you can fit onto a coffee table, and these are $14.99. And then I found this spider for $19.99. I do believe Jade hauled this in one of her videos. This is something, again, that I was tempted to buy for my son. And I might end up going back for him if he's still there. If he's not, then it's not a big deal. And then we have another inflatable, but this one is $12.99. And then they had this pumpkin that was dressed up as a bat. I thought that this was really cute. This was $12.99. And then they also have this one, and this one was also $12.99. Again, super cute. And they have this ceramic cauldron for $6.99, and this reminded me of one of the cauldrons that I seen at Joanne Fabrics, but honestly, I liked this one better and it was a much better price for $6.99. And then I found this Betsy Johnson skull handbag for $12.99. And then I found this stuffed zero for $19.99. And 
They have this Jack Skellington sitting on a jack-o'-lantern for $19.99. And then they had this skeleton pillow for $19.99 and this is something else I was contemplating buying because I think it would look very good on my couch. My couch is gray so it would match perfectly. <laughs> and then they had these hear no evil, see no evil, speak no evil skeletons for $9.99 a piece. <laughs> And then this witch's hat I saw from afar and I was in love with it from far away. But then the closer I got, I didn't really care for it. I kind of wish it was just like a solid black. Uh, I probably would have bought it then, but it's still cute nonetheless. And it is $16.99. <laughs> Now, these witch's boots actually light up. You can see the light through the spider web, and then it had this cute little glittery spider on it. And then I loved the little details on this boot, this boot, on these boots. There's like little wear and tear on them, and I just thought that it was a cute little touch to it. This is another item that we saw at Home Goods. So if you want a more detailed view of it, you can go check out the Home Goods video. And then they had this Jack Skellington blanket in the twin size for $19.99. And then they had this print in the full slash queen for $24.99. And then I'm just showing you the Jack Skellington pattern that's in the full slash queen for $24.99. And then they also have the other pattern in the twin size for $19.99. Anyways, we are nearing the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed today's walkthrough. I'm going again this weekend, so there will be more to come. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I hope to see you guys all next time. Bye!